What even is this house? Can't believe it. What kind of life did your parents live? Well then, enjoy your fancy flight for now. One month later. Hey, what's this about? Sorry, can you please break up with me? What? Stop embarrassing yourself anymore. The dad I'm Kiji Sato. So get this. I bump into my ex while heading for a work trip abroad. What? Look who's here. Isn't it Kiji? Kiji. Remember, my ex who grew up in the dumpy old house? Hey, tone it down. M Masaki? Masaki? Oh, you mean... Bingo. I'm Kiji's ex, and yeah, the president's daughter. Oh, her. Total nightmare, right? What? You're Masaki. The one who ran off as soon as she saw Kiji's parents' place, right? <sighs> You're really clueless about people. You can't see what really matters, huh? Hold up. Who even are you? Yeah, seriously. That's harsh. Harsh? You were the first ones to start mocking me as soon as you saw me, weren't you? And you claim it's some surefire joke. Come on, that's pretty rude. Whatever way you spin it. I was just speaking the truth. Anyways, why are you in first class? Sorry for the late introduction. I'm Yui Kiyuchi, Kiyuchi's personal secretary. S secretary? Kiyuchi is the president of Tokimeki Sports Gym. We're planning to go global, and I'm here to scope out our branch office. G going global? Wow, that's impressive. Hmm, <laughs> my guy Yuji's gonna be the next president of Doki Doki Silvers, that big financial company, right? Yeah, yeah, that's the plan. Wow, you work for a very good company. Impressive career you've got. You could have landed a better girl, though. What's that supposed to mean? I think it would be better for you not to be with someone who disses your ex the moment she bumps into him. At least your boyfriend isn't cool with how you're speaking and behaving. Seems like he's got some decency. Hey, you're not uncomfortable or anything, right? What? Er, I mean, it's kind of bothering the people around, you know? Ugh. <sighs> Well then, enjoy your fancy flight for now. Who knows when you'll have to slum it back at your folks' place again. Chill out, Misaki. Excuse me. <laughs> I'm gonna enjoy my time abroad. See ya. Enjoy your business class vibes. Ugh. They know we're in business class. Thanks, Yui. Oh, no problem. But you like that kind of girl, huh? I was young and foolish back in school, you know? Sure, sure. Thanks to Yui, my right-hand woman. The flight was a blast, and I was feeling hyped. Ugh, this sucks. Come on, cheer up. I checked out Tokimeki Gym, but it doesn't seem like that big of a company yet. That secretary's vibe freaked me out, but I should have spoken up. Hey, let's just enjoy the bash and lighten up. Yeah, you're probably right. Isn't it the birthday party for the prez of the foreign branch, right? I wonder what kind of fancy food they'll serve. Hold up. No way. Why is Kiji here? Huh? Oh, you are. Hey, your company has nothing to do with this party, right? Ah, oh, there you are, Yuji. What's your relationship with Kiji? I met him on the greens ages ago, back when my back was toast. He saved my bacon. Seriously, I never realized your swing messed up your back so badly. Man, let's not talk about that. Too embarrassing. Ha <laughs> ha. Can't, Can't believe, believe he's tight, tight with the press, too. too. By the way, I've heard you're planning to expand overseas, huh? Yep. Thanks to your help, I got my eye on some spots. It's looking good. Cool. Heard you've got Turkey Day Marketing helping out with the strategy, right? We're confident in our international strategy. We're happy to share some management advice with you. What do you say? Sounds awesome. What? If Kiji is reaching out to us for assistance, it suggests that Yuji will be leading the charge. We can't pass up this opportunity. You did say you wanted to work with Kiji, right? Huh? Oh, oh yeah, that's right. Really? Let's make Yuji part of the squad then. Do you have some sort of strategy proposal? Yeah, I've got it. Here it is. Yuji, check it out. Got it. Let me see. Hold up. Did this... With all due respect, this plan is just not doable. What? 
Are you serious? Honestly, I think taking on this project would be a huge risk for us. The plan is that sloppy. I mean, it's downright reckless. No way. I had Toki Day Marketing check it out thoroughly. But from what I saw, I don't know what Toki Day is thinking, but I can't recommend it. Then I'll contact Toki Day immediately, if that's all right with you. Yeah, sure. Absolutely. <laughs> that's my guy. You're the man I've been rooting for. Keep it up and show him you're the best. Oh, shoot. That was the plan I made three years ago. What? Actually, I tried to expand about three years ago, but backed out. Back then, I was still figuring things out. No wonder it's messed up. Hey, Yuji. Should have spotted this sooner. It's totally dated. The numbers and the dates? All three years back, huh? Oh, shoot. A hug. How did someone like you make such a rookie mistake? I know. Masaki and Yuji had an issue with Kichi. They were mocking him on the flight over here. Seems Kichi is Masaki's ex. So she's worried Yuji will fall short against Kichi. Th that's not true. I see. I'm not trying to dig into your personal stuff with your girlfriend. But as a pro, I've got to ask you to keep your personal feelings out of work from now on. Ugh. Oh, my bad. My father used to chew me out for being too competitive. I'll watch it from now on. Gotta go now. M Masaki. Yuji is always dealing with her drama. Really? He's a bit of a chicken. For better or worse. Probably scared to break up with her. Seriously, though. Bringing up stuff from three years back? Did you see this coming? Nah, actually, I really messed up. I'll be careful next time. I kinda like that clumsy side of yours, though, you know? Thanks. But I know he double-checked that date before giving it to him. I really respect him. The overseas expansion plan went smoothly over the next week, and I was back in Japan. I then decided to ask Doki Doki Silvers for some advice on company strategy and such. Yuji, you gotta do something about Kichi's plan. Hey, give me a break. I'm done with this. Don't bother him. No way. If he pulls this off, I don't want him to succeed while holding on to my secret. Hmm. So, I'm Yuji Tanaka, handling this case. Sorry about the other day. Nah, it's cool. Let's start with Tokimeki Sports Overseas Expansion Plan. Overseas folks tend to be naturally muscular. I think we need to beef up our equipment a bit more. Huh? What do you mean? I figured the gear we're eyeing is too weak for training. Maybe you're tight on cash, but you gotta aim for something a bit better. I don't think so. Other places already have top-notch setups like that. We plan this gym to make it more accessible to women, aiming for some differentiation. I mentioned that in the proposal, although not directly. I figured a sharp employee could read between the lines. Ugh. Yuji, I'm not one for hiding things or beating around the bush, so let me be straight. Maybe the reason you suddenly joined this project as an assistant and your suggestion earlier have something to do with Masaki, right? No way, that's just your prejudice talking. But there's no way someone like you would overlook something like this. You know, the president told me about you the other day. He said you're really excellent, but you've got a lot of issues in your personal life. That's... Listen, Yuji... Are you sure you want to continue like this as a professional? Is Masaki really that important to you? Hmm. If you can't answer right away, you should take your time to really think about it. it. It's none of your business. I wasn't sure if I should, but here's the deal. I'm gonna spill the beans about Masaki. Something to share? The truth about Masaki. She is... One month later. Hey, what's this about? Sorry, can you please break up with me? What? Why? I've been supporting you all this time. I just can't stand that you owe me attitude. Wait, what? You think it's okay to say that to me? You really think you can just do fine without me? Oh, my bad. I've got a stomach ache. Need to go to the bathroom. Hey, I'm talking serious here. Bet there's another woman in the mix, huh? Huh. These are Kiji's gym plans. Hmm. Just wait and see. I won't let you get away with breaking up with me. One week later. I am really sorry. Never thought you'd send out the wrong data with the wrong numbers and budget. You've caused tremendous damage to Kichi's company. It's alright. This is a human error. 
so there's nothing we can do about it. More importantly, there's something else I need to ask you. Is this really Yuji's mistake? Well, it was sent from Yuji's computer, so I triple checked everything before hitting send. Numbers were correct at the time, but the big question is, Yuji, believe in yourself, all right? Huh? Why did you call me in? Masaki, you probably already know, right? No, I have no idea. Masaki Endo, you tweaked our business plans and purchase orders, didn't you? Excuse me? What are you talking about? Where's your proof for this random accusation? I broke up with Yuji, so there's no way I could have touched his PC. It's weird that you're asking for proof. That makes you seem really suspicious. Of course, I do have proof. Huh? Yuji, smart move on your part. Your gutsiness saved you. I saved myself? You broke up with her, right? At the cafe where I gave you the discount coupon during our last business meeting? That cafe is run by my secretary's relative. Really? I never thought you guys would break up there. If we check the cafe's security camera footage, we should be able to prove that Masaki used Yuji's PC to some extent. And if we look into data deletion or email history from that time... All right, I get it. Yeah, I did use his PC, but so what? I didn't do it intentionally. It was an accident, I swear. Well, if you say so, that's a possibility too, but... What do you think about her side of the story? Huh? You're kidding. Stop embarrassing yourself anymore. The dad I remember how you kept boasting about your dad being a big shot. You're always flaunting it to Yuji, too. But the truth is, he's the president of a small-town factory. You were totally lying to show off, weren't you? Can't believe you actually found out. When I saw your reaction when you saw my parents' house, I couldn't understand why you cared so much about people's family backgrounds. You've had a tough life since you were little. That's why you've been trying so hard to put up a front and avoid going back to those days, right? Well, that's... Poor thing. I'm sure Yuji would have understood if you had just told him what you had gone through. But you didn't have the courage to say that, right? Because you were scared that he'd do the same terrible things to you that you did to Kichi, right? Ugh, enough already. Are you getting a kick out of exposing the real me? I'm really sorry you couldn't be straight with me. I take full responsibility for what happened. I'm really sorry that my daughter caused a lot of trouble. No, it's partly my fault too. You had nothing to do with this. It's me and Masaki who messed up. We'll split it and pay the company back for the damages. What? I'm apologizing this much and I still have to split the repayment? Seriously? I knew you weren't really sorry. Same old you, huh? Oops. Got it. We'll be billing both of you for this matter. Make sure you reflect on your actions while making a solid effort to repay. Misaki, remember what you said when you visited my parents' place? What even is this house? Can't believe it. What kind of life did your parents live? Life isn't just what you see on the surface. You can spend your life figuring that out. Ugh. Wish I could have done better. Why do I always end up like this? After that, they took on the responsibility of repayment and focused on their work. Yuji was given fewer sales tasks and instead focused on assisting other employees. At first, his pride got in the way and he was rebellious. But gradually, it seems he became more humble and focused on his work. Masaki started working at her family's factory. However, she kept trying to find a rich guy to marry but her bad personality got in the way, and now it seems like she can't even get a date. Meanwhile... Ah! Whoa, M my bad. No, sorry. Alrighty then, let's get cracking. Gonna make this overseas expansion a success. Because of this incident, we started noticing each other's charm and began to be drawn to each other. Thanks for watching to the end. Please subscribe to our channel too.